Hi, my name's Paul and I'm here to talk to you today about this, the Hive Smart Home System. Now, this just arrived to me from AO.com, so I'm going to do this review for them. But listen, this used to just be the Hive Thermostat. So it used to just be this box here, the Hive Thermostat. And what it would do is it would help you control the thermostat for your house, your boiler system for your house. Hooks up to your boiler, you can control your boiler, your thermostat, your hot water system through an app on your phone. It's, it's awesome, but it's grown since then. It's bigger now. It's an entire system. We have the door sensor. We have a light bulb. This is the smart plug is the motion sensor. What does this mean? Each one of these things can be controlled through your phone. These all talk to each other. They all talk to each other through the hub. Okay, through the smart hub that comes with all of these things. Now I'm going to start unboxing some of these things and seeing what they look like. I'm going to start with this, the main unit. This is the th the thermostat box, this is the thing that controls everything. Nice. Okay, so we've got some booklets here. This is an important one, this is your installation appointment booklet. So when you first buy this, you're not going to install it yourself. AO will deliver this stuff, and then what's going to happen is you are going to get a number inside of this booklet. You're going to get in contact with British Gas. You're going to give them that special number. And then they're going to send an engineer to your house. And the engineer is going to install the thermostat for you. And then you install everything else. It's really important. You're not going to install it. The British Gas guy is going to install it. It only takes about an hour to install. It's not long. And while the guy was here, he even did like a gas safety check on my boiler. So... I mean that makes it even more worthwhile getting the getting the British gas guys to come round. They're going to do a safety check. They're going to install your hive system. It's perfect. Oh man, this is nice. Okay. A oh. little bit of protective plastic. Oh, and in there as well. So it's really shiny. It's, it's kind of square and blocky, but oh man, I'm a fan of that. Buttons. I love buttons. It's got these buttons on the top as well. Yeah, oh man. Touchscreen is cool and everything, but I'm a big fan of buttons. And that that is a that is such a nice design. It's you know, it's shiny, it's silver. So how does this work? Okay, so it's got it's got um so I'm guessing this is gonna attach to your wall or whatever. Um and this just a little flick of that and it comes apart that's so simple yeah we have like a cover thing here I'm guessing you can maybe change these it's nice man they've, they've thought about that I mean it, this easily could have just been one of those like horrible white big massive dial on the front with just loads of numbers all over it but they've actually thought about the designers that I'm, I'm a fan I like that I like that a lot okay so we've seen the hive heating system and then everything kind of runs from here next thing we will look, look at is this door and window sensor oh you know what like good box design as well all right so we've got obviously a little bit of an installation booklet in here it's going to tell you all about your sensor how, how to place it on a door and then this is how it kind of sits in there Okay. Oh, it's got one of those little tabs, so as soon as you pull that, the battery starts going, so it's not wasting power in the box. And then this must just be the other, the other part of it. Oh, okay, so on the front, it's got this. I don't know if you can see that very well. It, it's kind of like a bit of a translucent part on the front of it, which is a really nice design, actually. Same on here as well. It's got a couple of... Looks like LED bulbs in the front of there. And again, it's got this really nice kind of transparent um, like part on the front of it. That's It's just a really nice design. It's really unintrusive as well. I mean, that there, it's tiny. That on your door, I like it. Okay, so this also comes with some sticky labels. So we're gonna move on to the next piece, which is the motion sensor. I mean, for me, I think motion sensor, I think one of those like horrible big boxes, you know, from a, an alarm system that sits in the top corner of your know, living room and it kind of like flashes red as you go past it. It's ugly. Okay. I hope this is a little bit better than that. Oh, 
but yeah, it is. The booklet again, it's gonna explain to you, you know, just the best way to, to fit this. Also got some sticky tabs, and again, really nice box design. It's got this tab, so when you pull that, the battery's gonna start. Oh, and that's cool, it's kind of, um, I don't know if you can see the, the shape of it. it, it it kind of is a not quite box it's kind of a triangle so it'll fit into a corner really easily and you look that that's thin look at that it's it's got these two little led things on the front of it it's got like this little circular thing which i'm guessing must be the motion center but it also has that slightly translucent thing um on the front that, that little design quality about it i love the silver around the motion sensor it's unobtrusive as well it's not one of those big, bulky, horrible, flashing red alarm boxes that sits in the corner. It, you can hide that really easily um, and still get a good quality experience out of it, I hope. Alright, moving on. We're looking at the Hive light bulb now. I'm going to pull this out of the box and see what it looks like. So, this one is the colour changing light bulb, which means it's dimmable, but you can also get it to like loads of different colours. Oh, this is interesting. 25,000 hours lifetime. So this is gonna last for 25,000 hours. How? What does that even mean? 1,041 days. You know, you're at work during the day most of the time. So this is on what? Four or five hours a night? This thing's gonna last you for a long, 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 long time. 25,000 hours. It's 806 lumens, that's pretty bright instant full light so it's not one of those energy saving bulbs that when you turn it on it takes a moment for it to kind of get up to full speed and it's a plus on your energy so it's really energy efficient too doesn't say how many different colors but i'm assuming there's going to be a lot so look okay and we got the user guide a bit smaller this one i mean it's a light fit and you screw it in it's easy right you can control all the app and there it is it's 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 kind of heavy. You can tell there's a, there's a lot of uh, science inside this. It's kind of like half light bulb, half, I don't know, fixing that's got all of the, um, all your Wi-Fi stuff in there so that you can control it with the app. Uh, I actually can't wait to see what I can do with this. The active plug. This is the Hive active plug. Again, it's Wi-Fi, you can control it with the app on your phone, it all works through the Hive smart home system. It's kind of like an amazing safety feature for your home, okay? I mean, that's the way I look at it. You know, let, let's say you want to plug a lamp into this, alright? You can turn the lamp on and off with your phone. Let's say you're going to be late home from work, let's say you've gone out for dinner. You can just turn a lamp on, make people think you're home. So, I really like the colour scheme on Hive as well, this grey and orange, it's nice. Okay, so we got the instruction manual. It's yeah, you just plug it in and you turn on turn on the plug and just leave the plug on and then this controls the, the flow of electricity. And then this is the hive active plug. It kinda looks like one of those plugs that you used to get um that would have like the timer on it, but this is just way smarter. Really nice that that again that translucent kind of finish on it. Uh, really nice design. They all seem to have this like silver circular ring. It's definitely a design feature. It makes it look quite nice. I mean, it's big. It's a it's a big plug. They've definitely put some effort into trying to make it look nice as well. You know what? This might be really good for. Probably the only thing that I tend to leave on all the time, and I I'm, I just leave it in standby all the time is my TV, because the plug for the TV is behind a a TV cabinet and I'm not going to pull the TV cabinet out every time I want to turn a TV off on the evening um, so when you know when you go to bed you could just knock everything off standby because you've got your TV soundbar your PlayStation your Virgin mobile media box your sky box whatever your DVD player they're all on standby they're all eating electricity so maybe you use this to uh, to turn them all off when you go to bed so you don't have to pull that TV cabinet out every single time. Alright, so that's everything out of the box. First thoughts, I, I think they've actually really thought about making the design of it really nice. Um, it's not clunky, it's smooth, it's got 
really nice design qualities, which which I really appreciate. Um, I love the uh, like the mirrored finish on the on the thermostat box. It yeah, it, it's kind of like they want it to fit in, but not stand out too much, but also be noticeable that it's really nice, which which is cool. So yeah, I'm gonna go get in contact with British Gas. I'm gonna get them to install this bad boy so I can get all these things working in my home. I'll be with you in a minute.